Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, the TV was up. <laughs> uh, tonight, we're going to be talking about because I finally, finally graduated. I'm done. And these are my new glasses. Baby, you like my new glasses? Mm hmm We got Tracy. Oh, wrong camera. Where's Tracy at? Oh, there she is. We got to fix that background. That background's falling. We'll fix that later. Mm -hmm. It's okay. So, how's everybody doing tonight? Um, I just wanted to do a quick 30-minute show, um, you know, just talking about, you know, what I did in school. Because I don't really do a show about myself. Actually, I don't think I ever did. Yeah. So, um, while we eat Robinson's popcorn. Um, hold on, let me, uh, let me get something over here. Okay. So, I grad I started I have full sale in 2020, January of 2020. Um, got my associate's degree. In two years. And, bachelor's and then in two months. years, two more years, I did bachelor's mm -hmm. and uh, same thing, you know, digital cinematography. Uh, and it was crazy because I never, when did I ever think in my life that I would have my bachelor's degree? Never. I never yeah. thought about that. For not, for not graduating high school. Thanks, okay. babe. <laughs> <laughs> you want to say that again, babe? At the camera? I'm saying, since you didn't graduate from high school, you graduated from college. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, I don't even have that over there. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, Matt. I'm going to let her know. Or you'll, okay. You'll see it. Why does it smell like cigarettes? You smell that? Or maybe it's just popcorn. Oh, no. The popcorn. I mean, the popcorn don't smell like cigarettes, but the, I don't know. Um, got my associate's degree. Hold on, I gotta click on this. There it goes. Look what Matt says. Okay, so you got, but she don't need her finished sentences. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, um, I, thanks Matt for joining as well. So, I, uh, you know, I, I graduated uh, with a associate's uh, associate's degree first mm -hmm. in digital cinematography, and I thought, you know what, which I didn't think <laughs> I should have just kept going, but oh, I, master? I started, yeah, I start. Wait, what? How many more years to get your master's degree? I don't. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh, I'm done. No, I don't know. I might do something like that, but later down the road. You know what? I'm not going to eat during the show, but Robinson's popcorn. <laughs> Thanks for making more noise, babe. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, so yeah, we, uh, or I, let me give you a little bit of history. 2013, I started, well, I already had a business going, but I changed the name. Oh. Because it was actually a different name. I was going to... It was Bro. Huh? B-R-O Studios. Please. No. Bro Studios. Where'd you get that from? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, it was actually called... And Matt remembers this. Twin Star Studios. Oh. Because me and Matt were going to get on it and he backed out because he's a loser. I'm just kidding. All right. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think but, you're uh, spot, man. Thanks for backing out, dude. No. Thanks for giving me a spot. Yeah. <laughs> well, Matt's back in because he's one of our promoters. So, um, he anyway. He's one of our promoters? So, babe, we've already discussed that. That's cool. I mean, let's look at Tracy right now. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, hmm. anyway, so I started, that That was the original name. And then I thought, you know what? I want it to be more West Michigan, you know, because we're here, we're in West Michigan, and I thought, oh dang, what the heck? And and so I'm driving. I don't remember where. I think I was over by South Haven, but I was driving north, and I saw Black River. You know, a sign that said Black River. So it made me think. You know, oh okay, that's a good one, because the the river or the spot in Holland mm -hmm. was called Black River at one point. And so, oh, I'll do that. I'm going to use that. So that's what I changed it to Black River Studios. Well, actually, actually, it was Black River Films. 
And I thought, no, we we do more than just films and other stuff. So I did that. I changed it to Black River Studios, and that's where it's been. So flash forward to 2020, I thought, you know what? I need to, because I've been doing the podcast since 2018, off and on. And I mean, it's been fun ever since, but um, we, or I don't keep saying we, I'm not in the we part yet. So I thought to myself, you know, I'm going to find a way to improve myself with when it comes to film and photography and things like that. So I'm browsing, and I found a school called Full Sail University out of Winter Park, Florida. I don't know if anybody's ever heard of that. But I started that, and it's almost like, I'm trying to think of, well, uh, let's see here. Pretty much where they basically... It, uh, it, it, they, I can't think of the word. Uh, provided, that's what I was trying to say. They provided everything that they needed, that, you know, whatever their students needed. So if you're going in for music, they provide you everything that you need for your, for your music degree. So I thought, oh, they do film, they do, uh, uh, film degrees. So I was like, sweet, that's perfect. Then so I that's got, what cinematography is? Mm -hmm. Cinematography is basically, you're behind the scenes no matter what. You can, yeah, you can do casting. You hire people for casting, but that was part of our degree too, was casting. Mm -hmm. So pretty much anything you can think of that has to do with the film studio was involved in this, both these degrees. Dang. So I could pretty much do everything <laughs> if I wanted to, but I'm not. So that's why we're, why I need to hire some people. Anyway, so... What I didn't know was when I was going through the, what they call a launch box. And what that is, is it, it, you get a laptop, you get camera, you get microphones, lighting, you get the whole nine yards, uh, or whatever it is that you're doing. So I thought that was pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Um, also that once you graduate, you keep all of that. You don't have to give it back. Oh. That's great. And these cameras are really, I'll show you. Mm -hmm. These ones. Those are nice. These are the cameras that we use. So, I mean, that's freaking heavy. So this is like really, really professional. Really, really professional. But anyway, uh, yeah, so I got two of these. And so... That's what we're that's what we we're using here. That's Black River Studios. So uh, <laughs> I can't remember what I did that. Anyways, uh, so I just I think that you know it's been fun. You know, so I'm gonna play a video real quick. I don't think I showed you this. Okay. Now I'm not naked in this, so be it's okay. <laughs> so let me play this video. I'll put it over here. Actually, I gotta turn up the volume. The volume. I don't think I showed you this. Whoops. I don't know why that's on. No. Science and digital cinematography. This is my list. Bye. Elon is the salutatorian of the program. Oh, here it goes. This is speaking. Ryan Tilling. After this one is when Mike starts. Cameron Walker. Okay. Our next graduates are receiving their Bachelor of Science in Here's me. Cinematography. How come you're not dancing? Gracie's dancing. Brandon Bradbury. D'Angelo Bowen. Can't stop. I'm just Andy Bai. I'll tell you something about this when I'm done. Or when this, when Anthony done. Cabrera. Thanks, Alejandro. Appreciate it, Alex. Pre I don't know why I said your name like that. I already call. I always call you Alex. David. <laughs> Morgan DeRosia. I'm just. It's it's fun. You know, it's fun Dixon. to do. I. 
That Xavier Castillo guy, I did some projects. I, Adam, I, Adam Ebner. I did a critique on his videos. Really? Teresa mm -hmm. Estrada. Him too. The D. Allen, D. Allen Joe. D. Allen Joe. Oh my God, I can't Shannon say Shannon Fogarty. Mm -hmm. It's in alphabetical order. Oh, it is? Luis Santino. Oh, him. did they mess that up? I didn't even notice that. <laughs> Pierre Hernandez Sanchez. Boom. Benjamin Herrera. Yay, there's my name, everybody. I you know I'm gonna play it push pause on that. That's my proof, guys, that I graduated because it's coming up on your screen. There I am, look at me. So uh I you know, like I said, I, I well I'm not even on camera. <laughs> I forgot to switch the camera. What is my degree? But I think that if you feel like, you know, you can't do anything, it, it, you can do it. Just push back all the negativity because, you know, I was, there's been times where I wanted to quit. Of course, trust me. Mm -hmm. There was times where I'm like, I'm not doing this. I can't do this anymore. Oh, yeah, excuse me. And it was like two or three times. Yeah. I mean, but it, it got to a point where everybody. But you stuck through it. Yeah, everybody that I can think of, family, friends, especially Tracy, told me don't quit because I'm almost done. Mm -hmm. So I was like, okay, okay fine. Keep that. going, keep going. Yep, yeah, and you kept going. Mm -hmm. And so the thing is, is that we, and this is where the we comes from, we as a business of Black River Studios um, really, really needed and I did this for everybody that's involved too, family, friends, everybody, because I looked at it as it's an opportunity for the Holland area to gain, a, for one, another business, two, a business that will cater to the local community and help others uh, local, get their business out there. Other local you know? businesses. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Tracy, you want to say that again? Oh, uh, we're here to support other local businesses, too. Exactly. We like to be supported, but we support, uh, as we're supported, we're able to support others. Exactly. Because people, and that's the thing is, like, when when I started this business, I looked at it, I, I, my vision was, for one, was to create jobs. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, this area, I mean, didn't really lose too much jobs over the last 10 years, but... It's uh, it, it became Holland became a hub of new businesses in the last five years, actually. And so there's a lot of. Who she no, we didn't. She don't read my text messages. Read your text messages. Um, and so the fact that I tried to you know start this business like 10 years ago yeah and it just felt like it was just lagging nothing was going on and but, so it made me think you know what maybe i should just go to school for it you know get you know get more familiar with things mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and so bff what's up kiki hi kiki <laughs> oh she's uh there she is so um hi kiki I thought I tagged you in it. I think I did. But uh, I just think it's fun. It's a fun job mm -hmm. because our crew that we have does an amazing job getting Let's things together. Mention your crew. Say who's all in your crew. Okay, so we got, we got well, first, uh, Tracy has been by my side through this whole process. Thank you. It's cool. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's let's give her a applause because she's she put up with some crap, <laughs> and so she really uh, stood by my side through the whole the whole thing. Yeah, all my friends and family did, but you know, what up, skeptical critic? What's going on? Uh, so I just felt like like she definitely was the one to tell me not to not to quit. So. 100% towards her on that part. Uh, of course, we got family and friends that helped. And um, thank Matt 
for doing uh pitching in first time for my some of my videos in the past mm -hmm. my training videos that i did uh, uh, yeah training video remember the one at the, in the garage i remember oh that garage. not that one but i'm talking well that one too but um the uh remember it was bouncing the basketball at oh, the park okay. in zealand yeah oh yeah that's right was that your phone or mine that was yours oh anyway <laughs> oh excuse me she says hi to you tracy oh thank you Oh, oh 45 <laughs> cents. Thanks. That's right. Thanks, sis. KK. Appreciate it. Uh, so, yeah. Um, so, my crew is uh, Tracy, of course. She is, once we get, okay, I'll tell you. About it. Anyway. Okay. Okay. So, Tracy, and we got Malik, who's been on the podcast for two years, almost two years. Uh, Marcos. Okay. About Malik is months. our. Huh? Six months to a year for Marcos. Yeah, Malik is basically considered our assistant manager. Assistant. Uh, Tracy is considered secretary or office person. Yeah. Oh, person. <laughs> office person. <laughs> Tracy, you're an office person. <laughs> I'm an office person. <laughs> yeah. So uh, huh. then we got Malik, who, like I said, is an assistant manager. Mm -hmm. uh, then we got Marcos, who's our promotion uh, production manager. And then we got Brandon Robinson, who is our sound uh, engineer? He did a really good job last night on fixing this video or the audio part to this video that we're doing for a band that we recorded last Saturday. Which that's almost done. Excuse me. And uh, so I'm looking. Um, we. We got our first sponsor tonight, That's and awesome. uh, so that was really cool for the show. And who, um, can we say who our sponsor is? Uh, not till Monday. I'm gonna oh, I'm gonna mention okay. it on Monday. Okay. Um, Monday you'll you'll hear who our sponsor is. We gotta still get all this uh, together, but um, he's a well known person in our in our in our community. That's cool. Well respected, um, uh, business owner. So you'll 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 hear his name on on Monday. Monday show. I'll tell you afterwards, babe. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tracy's excited. Yeah, like, I want to know who but, it is. But <laughs> um, that will be on Monday show, um, which we have waving back on Monday. Oh, I thank you. They said it was nice to meet your wife. Oh, thank you. Oh, my. You know what? I can't show it right now because my sleeves too short or too short. Not long. Well, thank you, Isaiah. <laughs> it was nice yes. meeting you too. <laughs> Well, at the gym. Yes, yes babe. That's yeah, the one we were talking to, talking with. That's cool. Yeah, it was nice. <clears> to <throat> it was, <laughs> but it was good catching up to you, Isaiah. Mm -hmm. uh, Isaiah, that was cool. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so you know, we all work as a team. You know, we mm -hmm. we all have ideas. We all have things that we want for the business, and I appreciate all of them. They help. And out I appreciate good. how you did a little film on being bipolar. Yes, I did yeah, that. That was awesome. I hope yep, you had a good grade cool. for that, too. I did. I got 100%. That's cool. That's because That's cool. I'm cool. Mm. Mm. But, yeah, I uh, I learned a lot, actually. There was a lot of stuff that I'm thinking, like, how in the world did I even not know that? Because you know why? I didn't, I didn't wasn't really doing the behind-the-scenes stuff at that time. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, it wasn't, like, what I'm doing now. I wanted to be in front. I wanted to be an actor. But I suck oh, at that, so okay. I can't do that. <laughs> but that's what you originally wanted? Yeah, I wanted to be an actor. Yeah. That's what really got me into it. So, But uh, I think that uh, things are things are looking up. Um, mm -hmm. we're, we're hopefully going to be having a building, a space for the business, podcast, cameras, like photography. What do you think, within a month or a couple of weeks? Or? I'm hoping very soon because like we want to get in it soon. Um, uh, uh, I, I think what, what it is, is, oh, I forgot to wear my hat. Oh my God. Yeah. Oops. Do I look cool with this hat on or does it look stupid? No, you look serious. Good. Because <laughs> I am. <laughs> anyway. So, uh, but I do, I do want to say this too. Um, for all of the supporters in the last four years, pretty much. My mom, my brothers and sisters, cousins, uh, friends, all my friends, aunts and uncles, all my followers, huh? Aunts and uncles. I said family. 
Okay. Don't interrupt me. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, all the followers, you know, uh, I wouldn't have done it without you guys, and I thank everybody for allowing me, or not giving up on me for one, and not allowing me to quit what I was doing because I was I was in the verge of doing that a couple of times, mm -hmm. and I didn't do it because of you know, and of course. I got I got to give a shout out to Kiki BFF. Mm -hmm. Your name came up, yeah. uh, and of course, last but not least, my my wife and kids. Oh, yeah. uh, mm -hmm. They they've been through a lot uh, without fine. seeing me. You will succeed. I'm proud of oh. you, Ben. <laughs> I can't believe I have known you since you were a little boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's right. he, and he said Appreciate he's, it. He said he's your mom's age, so he, he knows your mom. Well, yeah, they all grew up. They, they all grew up they, together? together? Well, I mean, I think they all went to school together. Or went to school together, yeah. Something like that. But, That's um, cool. yeah, so I think I just cracked my knuckle on my finger hurts. <laughs> anyway. But uh, you know, like I said, over the over the time of doing the show, I I knew that it was going to keep going because I have those visions. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I was going to say something stupid, but okay, good. I was going to say that damn song, "Sugar Plums Dancing in My Head." <laughs> <laughs> right. But oh, I love you! I can't wait to see you. I know, right? See her. Oh, uh, we can't. Oh, yeah. She's doing pictures of me tomorrow. Oh, for real? Yeah. That's cool. About 2.30. And then, uh -huh. uh, then the gathering's going to happen about 4 o'clock. Right on. I'm probably not going to have food uh, tomorrow, but we'll figure something out. Mm -hmm. uh, so, if it, oh, that's another thing. Uh, tomorrow, if anybody wants to stop by, say hi. Um, I'm just going to have a gathering from 4 to 8. Probably won't even be that long, but... Just to say hi, you know, visit the studio. Uh, if you've never been in here, come, you know, check it out, whatever you want to do. Um, just don't touch anything. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, um, I'll post it on Facebook. But I do, like I, I, I do appreciate everybody that's helped me along the way. Um, my dad, obviously, too. And, uh, but, you know, Marcos and Malik, um, they, they've definitely helped me get, you know, bigger than where I was before because they, they know a lot of people <laughs> mm -hmm. and it made me know a lot of people. And Matt knows a lot of people. Well, Matt too. Mm -hmm. Um, and it just, I kept growing and it's still growing and it's going to get bigger because I'm not going to quit. I'm not going to give up. And I'm going to do it until I release a movie. It's awesome. Just one movie and then I'm retiring. I'm just <laughs> uh, <clears throat> that's another thing that I do as well. Um, you know, we film, we do film editing, uh, photography, uh, graphics, sound. We, you know, we do everything. We're a one-stop shop film company studio uh, that Black River Studios. Now, it's a name that is going to be known and I'm going to make it known mm -hmm. because I'm not, I didn't go to school for nothing. And I'm going to tell you guys that one. Remember the name black river studios, because I don't have a logo anywhere, which is funny. <laughs> oh yeah. But you had a t-shirt, right? Oh yeah, I do. You got a t-shirt logo. Except I don't know where it's at. Go give me that picture off that wall over there. If you can get it out. If you're tall enough. <laughs> Okay, but on. don't knock anything down. So, uh, I uh, I designed this logo myself. Be I mean, uh, also, I have a original logo that uh, Lalo Salcido uh, designed for me a couple years back. Did a great job on it. So, uh, if you need a logo, get a hold of him. So, <clears throat> I designed this one. And it's very, it's going to be on everything, everything that I do. This is the logo that I that I designed. I designed it on Photoshop. What was that for? Illustrator, not Photoshop. And it was pretty cool because I thought to myself, 
I want it to look old school. And so this is what I came up with. So mm -hmm. I also got my Black River Studios thing on here. I mean, uh, Full Sound Universe. Yeah, Full, full Sound. <laughs> and then I got my K.O. Cuts one on here. K.O. Cuts, you're about to get free. Or free advertising right there. Right. But, uh, you know, it's... Okay, so here's something that people need to learn. Well, it's it's a known fact that most film companies are you don't get paid until we get paid. Right. Because where am I going to get the money from? We have to film. We have to make something and sell it to theaters and produce uh, other uh, production companies to expand and get it across nation. And then uh, that's where we make money. So there's a lot, of, you know, the distributors out there that, that help. Like, you know, when you watch a movie and it has like four different companies at the beginning of the credits. Oh, right. That's because you can go through other companies where you can distribute your film and then they produce it and whatever. Or not produce it, but uh, help you distribute it to other theaters throughout the country. And if you know how another thing is where they say, oh, and selected theaters. Yeah. Because you they put it in certain theaters to see how good it does. Oh, okay. If it gets high ratings and people are enjoying it, then that's when they expand it to all, all the theaters. That's nice. Or how, oh, whoever for instance, wants it. We got Holland 7, AMC, and Sperry's. And Knickerbucker. And Knickerbucker. We have four, four theaters here. So it's like. I, I I just that's why I started this business was to do film. Oh, James and so, Thomas. What I up? Know. Oh yeah, James. I got to play that video. Uh, so <laughs> you just reminded me. So James has a video that he wanted me to share. Oh okay. Uh, hold on. I gotta get, I gotta find it real quick. So <clears throat> let me find it real quick, James. Uh, I just clicked on it. Where'd it go? That's weird. I don't know why I did that. Oh, there it is. That's weird. I... Okay, so let me take that one off. Here we go. Uh, he wanted me to share this video of Malik clubbing in the 1980s. So. Me, uh, coming in 1980s. Hold on, I gotta change it to. It's somebody else, right? Obviously, babe. Okay. <laughs> I guess. Hold on, let me rewind it because it started before I do. That's a good one. That's freaking hilarious. <laughs> if you want to ride, oh, that's don't good. ride the white horse. That's good stuff. Mm -hmm. Good one, James. But, um, so yeah, I think, um, like I said, uh, I, I'm i looking for more help. If anybody, like, wants to be involved, let me know. Uh, we can find a spot. We got... You know, I can need help with getting the studio ready for the for the for the show. Um, you know, cleaning and I don't know, we'll figure it out. We got jobs. Um, again, you don't get paid until we get paid. That's the way this business works. Uh, now, there are times where, obviously, if you have like an eight to four job there at the, at, at uh, the studio. We'll figure out. We will, we'll get. We'll get it taken care of. So, on that note, who wants to help? Tracy, you want to help? Just kidding. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, oh, he said it. what happened with Malik and Marcos. You oh, Malik you is uh, going to be here later. The info. They both couldn't uh, make it. Oh, yeah. I'll give you that info. Says, you better hit me up, BFF. I want the info. Kiki, you could be one of our photographers, actually. That would be a good idea. Um, she's good with photography. Okay. Oh, she's real good. Um. Oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, Isaiah, so I'll let you know, too. That that's a, I can help if you need help. Just let me know when. Oh, that'd be cool, Isaiah. Thank mm -hmm. you. There you go. So let me write your guys' names down so I don't forget. Yep, write it down. I need a... All right. I'll read you this after after the show because I don't want you to read it out loud. Okay. Yeah. But look what Brandon wrote on here. <laughs> Oh, Thanks a lot, Brandon. <laughs> All right, so we got Isaiah and Kiki. And Kiki. Oh, she says, I'm down to do pictures, just like you said. You know? Oh, awesome. I'm proud of you. Proud of you too, babe. Don't worry. Oh, thank you. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I think um, I, I think the business is, is, is growing. It's... Uh, Again, we like I said, we got a sponsor that I'm going to mention on Monday. That we start on Monday with his his sponsorship. So, and when we know, have sponsors, is that once a month? That's per, some people is per episode. Per episode, oh, okay. What you oh, oh, that's something. I have a lot I, of tapes. That we'll talk about that later. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, so yeah, definitely. Um, Oh, I'm over my 30 minutes. Whoopsies. But I, I think that um, going to full sale was a great learning experience, especially because it made me realize how smart I was. <laughs> no, it made me it made me realize that, you know, if you want to live your dream, then do it. Mm -hmm. Because in like the whole example of if you go to work, or if you create a business and you call it work, then it's not going to be fun. Right. You have to have fun with your business with something you love. Right. However you say that, I probably said it all wrong. <laughs> but I don't know why I keep it. <laughs> there, now I'm good. I had to let that one out. And so I, I believe that I believe that everything will work out. Everything's looking good. Mm -hmm. um, we just got to keep at it. And we you know? just do it one day at a time. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, Black River Studios will be known nation. Na bleh, if I can talk nationwide soon. And I will make sure of that. Because that was my goal when I started this business. Was to, for one, learn more about it. And, and gain more knowledge about it. Put the name out there wherever I can do it. And so one thing, too, is <clears throat> the podcast. Um, I've been doing that, like I said, for since 2018. And it's been growing ever since. You know, I stopped it for, what was it, four months? Four or five months? Yeah. Because I was in a position of school where I couldn't do both of them at the same time because yeah. I had to film stuff at that time. So it kind of like pushed me back on how what I can do. Then I started doing everything again. Everything was working out. And then I started at Renaissance Center in, at the, in October of last year. And they've helped me out too with that as well. Got a lot of, a lot of good co-workers there. Mike, Austin, Matt, and Sylvia. They've all helped me out. <clears throat> they know that what I was doing was for my dream right. and so they you know they all did what they could to help and i, was, I appreciate that i think i tagged sylvia in this so she better see that <laughs> yeah. look what i smile my glasses go up 
Did your glasses do that? Mm -hmm. Let me see. No, they don't. My glasses are cooler than yours. <laughs> yeah, did it again. <laughs> I just noticed that. Anyways, <clears throat> all right, well, I'm going to go ahead and call it a night. Um, again, I want to appreciate everybody that's been involved, all my guests, everybody that's been on the show. You have everybody behind me right here that's been on the show. I'm going to name them all. Hold on. Yeah, go ahead. So we got up here at the top, we have Demetrius Lake, one of the all-time scorers in the state of Michigan in high school. Uh, in the professional league across overseas. Oops, good one. And then next to it, we got Elias Rodriguez. What up, Rod Rodriguez? Holy crap, I didn't take a minute. Oh, well. He'll see it. And then we have Lee <clears throat> Leland Cooper from Cooper's Kitchen. And then, of course, we had Michael Martinez from... Well, he's a guitarist. As you can see in the picture. Can you see that picture? Hold on. Oh, yeah. Let me move this number. Let me move this down here so people can see it. <clears throat> All right. So, and then we got one of the most other famous people in Holland, Eric Lozano. We got him. He's got a fight coming up soon. And then we got Theo, who is a awesome DJ. And then we got Joey Ochoa, who we are going to be doing a film documentary about him. Probably doing a full-length movie. Uh, who He just signed with a uh, record, has signed a record deal. Okay. And then we got Robinson's Popcorn, who was just here last week. Right. Who actually uh, passed the record for most views on the show. Nice. He's just over 2,000 views. Okay. Uh, and then we have Shanette, one of our really good friends, who's a coach, basketball coach for. Um, I thought elementary for high school. Kuiper, right. Kuiper, Kuiper College. University. Kuiper College. And then we got Linda, Linda Love, really good food with Linda Love. And then we have Deuce Dalla, who's uh, was also on the show. He's also a, 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 an art music music artist. Or how would you music say? Artist. Rapper. Yeah, rapper. He's really good. He's got good music as well. Check him out. Joey Ochoa and Deuce and... Um, oh, the other guy can't be... He's not on here because he wasn't in person, but we had Deuce Carter on as well, which was... Was that Wednesday night? Yeah. Yeah. Wednesday night, we had him on. And then right here, I don't know if you can see it, we had Sue, who's the owner of... which was called Lemongrass, but is now called Fusion Thai Kitchen. I still almost said chicken. Yeah, kitchen. <laughs> and then we had Jerry Bang, who talked about the, the um, what do you call it, medical part of the marijuana, which actually oh, helps people. Right. So he, ha he was on a couple weeks back. So, you know, oh, oh, one more. And then we have Ati's painting that I bought from her. Yeah, we have Ati Forston's painting. Ooh, mm -hmm. yes, that was that was a good that was a good painting. I liked it. That's why I have it there. Mm -hmm. So you know we've had really good people on here um, that definitely is doing great things with their life and great things for their careers. Um, and we can all be like that, like that. You know, we can all be able to live our lives and do what we want with our with our our careers if you go that route if you want to be uh, a truck driver if you want to be a, a custodian or whatever it is that by all means do it that's what you want to do Not, nothing wrong with that nobody's better than anybody else so um but where it's wherever you take your career do it and whatever you have whatever you enjoy the most so, but I want to thank everybody who, like I said, has been by my side. My wife, Tracy. Thank Let's you. put her on camera. Love you, babe. I know you, I know you could do it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Now give me hugs and kisses. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're not doing your face. No. 
There. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, uh, but yeah, I think, uh, man, I could, I could just keep going, but I'm not. <laughs> There's so many people that I can thank. Uh, Matt, Heather, Josh, Eddie, uh, Lauren, um, <clears throat> Stacy, Stevie. Stevie gave me some good ideas. Mm -hmm. uh, Uncle Steve, Uncle Mark, Uncle Mike, everybody. Everybody, uh, mm -hmm. all my aunts and uncles. Uncle Joe. Uncle Joe, yep, for sure. Uh, you know, it's both sides of the family, actually. Yeah. yeah. I don't even know why I didn't say that. Uh, my cousin Jeff. Uh, it's, there's too many people in there. Terry, Aunt Terry. That's Amy right. Moses. Yeah, oh, right? Amos, Amy Moses panties with roses. <laughs> Everybody remembers that. I think it's his hat doing that. It was a hat. Okay. So, um, yeah, there's just a lot of people. Johnny Garcia for cutting my hair. That and cutting Kale our cuts. son's hair. Kale Thank cuts. For cutting our son's hair, too. Yes, kale cuts. Um, dang. There, there was a tattoo shop that did my tattoo, but I don't think they're there anymore. Yeah. I forgot the name of it. Uh, I remember Don't Tell Your Mother in Zealand. Yeah, it wasn't that one. But good things. Good thing for telling. Mm -hmm. but good thing for giving them a plug, babe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, I want them to succeed too, but dang. <laughs> no. Uh, and of course, we're in the center of my job because, they, like I said, they... And Best Buy. They but. I don't work for Best Buy anymore. I know, but we should. I mean, I did at one point. Yeah. So. Of course, Best Buy actually for all the cameras because they're the ones that where I bought most of these. <laughs> so don't start crying yet. Wait until you're off the air. If I, <laughs> I know, right? Um, and all the ones that you know have passed away over the years. Uh, Jamie. Uh, Jamie. Uncle Joe, Grandpa, Grandma. Joe, Grandma, Grandpa. You know, Mike. Oh, cousin Mike. I was like, what? Mm -hmm. Um, uh, and and uh, Herman, Mrs. Dead. Oh yeah, Mrs. you know, yeah. It's like we we gotta we gotta you know take care of each other. So, and that's another reason. Like I said, the reason behind this business was mm -hmm. to take care of each other, be there for each other, and be able to. Provide that voice, that's that place for that voice that you want to release. You got a story to tell. You have a business you want to promote. Come on the show. Let me know. Mm -hmm. Let one of us know. Um, <clears throat> so, <laughs> but uh, again, I appreciate everybody. So, all right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and call it tonight. I got to do a meeting for our employees and. Uh, We'll see you guys, uh, what's today, Friday? We'll see you Monday night with our new sponsor. and Well, not with him, but talking about him. And then, um, Wavy Mac. Wavy, you better show up, dude, or I'm going to punch you. On uh, Monday? <laughs> what? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> but anyways. All right, well, everybody have a good night, and we will see you next Monday. Peace. Love.